Hey guys! New series on our channel. I think this is a new series. Is it? Top five? Yeah. Where we list down the top five of a product or a brand. This video is Blush Top 5. We're doing their shampoo bars. Shampoo bars, specifically. And we're gonna go from five, which is the worst of the best. Correct. There you go. To top spot, which is number one. And here we go. Number five is Copperhead. Which is like um, a shampoo bar that has like coffee infused into the... And mix. henna. And, and henna. This is mixing. It's good if you have dyed hair especially because of the, the henna. If and you didn't know henna is like, what would you say? It's an all natural way to dye your hair and color treat your hair. So if you dye your red a lot, um, this really maintains that red in your hair. If that's not to say if you use it, it's like gonna hurt your hair in, in any way if you don't have dark hair, because I've used it. One of the reasons why I, I list it as top five is because when it gets wet, for two, well obviously it has to get wet, it's a shampoo, uh, right. you know, wash your that's, hair with that's, it. That's, that's, that's what you do in the shower. But it kind of crumbles apart. I don't know specifically why it does that. I don't know. There's something in it that breaks it apart. The copperhead, it falls, crumbles a little bit apart. So it's kind of hard to use. That's why it's, at, you know, in the fire spot because it crumbles pretty much. Crumble. Crumbly. Number four, Resilient. Which is like a very brilliantly colored orange shampoo bar. And it smells like oranges. Very citrus smelling. I like the smell of this one also. I like it because of the smell and I like it because it does make your hair look healthy. Right, which I think is like the vitamin C kind of stuff from the citrus. But I found it kind of made your hair a little bit shiny. That makes it look healthy. But it wasn't like the most revolutionary thing. No. Right. So there you go. If you're looking for that, there it is. Number three, Jumping Juniper. Jumping I Juniper. love this one. It smells like gin in a bottle. Which is the juniper. It's a very herbal smell. So if you don't like herbal, you won't like it. It's not potent in any way. Good for greasy hair. It is good for greasy hair. And the lavender that's also in it is just It's kind of like aromatherapy. It's also soothing. It, it, this is even better like in the middle than Brazilian is. I feel which like is why it uh, brings the nutrients back to your hair and makes it less frizzy and more balanced. But at the same time, I feel like I get volume too when I use it. Yeah. And that is Jumping Juniper. So number one and number two were kind of like, mm, we disagree, but I feel like they're both pretty good. Correct. My number two would be Monteblano, and my number one would be Scenic, which would be her number two spot. Right. Which one do you want to talk about first? We can talk about Scenic first. So Scenic, which I've been washing my hair with. If you know their ocean salt scrub, it smells just like that. And it's blue. It has um, sea salt in it, and it also has a uh, kelp, and that's not it. Not kelp. <laughs> Seaweed. If you're looking for a good clarifying shampoo, this, this is for you. Right. You've had too much crap in your hair for too long. Don't Products right. galore. Or this is really greasy scalp. This is this is a good one for you. I would this use this as a Sunday it. shampoo, like as a clarifying shampoo. I could use it every time I wash my hair, but I like to save it to like really like clean my hair good. Scenic is pretty much a clarifying shampoo. With a little bit of volume, I think, thrown in there somehow. Mm -hmm. Another one or two spot is Malzablano. It is a lemony smelling one, which is kind of delicious. kind of biased because I love the lemon. But Push. I don't like the chunks. The it's, little lemon chunks, I'm not a fan. It's got lemon chunks and it has rosemary in it as well. Kind of like Brazilian and kind of like... Jumping Juniper. There we go. Jumping Juniper. I can't, I can't think. It's the end of the day. It um, adds that shine and adds that balance back to your hair. The thing with this one, I feel like it also clarifies at the same time, but not excessively like Scenic. Which is why I like to use it more as like an every time shampoo. Because it does all of the above. It doesn't make your hair greasy. It's just, it's a really like... But every day. This would be good for most people, I think. Hard to choose between. One. Scenic and Multiplano. So if you like top five videos, let us know down in the comments. And like and subscribe. Ring the bell. <laughs> and follow us on Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, and Instagram. And until next time, see ya real soon. Bye. Love ya. Bye. I'm gonna have to move the chair. No. What the fuck? And now he's can't. You legitimately went under the chair, under the desk, and now you're trying to slow the backwards. The tripod's right there. Be careful. Good thing your shoulder's on as broad as your ass, because if it was, we would have had a problem. If it's tank, it's, it's blocking my view.
<laughs> it does it. It does its job. It does it. It does it. it, does it. <coughs> <coughs> She been sick. She's sick. Home girl was holding that in. Who? Who day? Usually that's me. <clears throat> mm. That recorded. Mm. We got.